Well, hello and welcome to Eco Farm. This is episode four. In this episode, we are going to plant our new fields. It's just a question of what we're going to plant. It's not going to be too much of a mystery, really. <laughs> um, I think what we'll do is when the field ahead of us here, we'll uh, plant some more oats. And then in the big field, I will plant some sorghum, I think. Yeah, sorghum. Just to get some cash crops going. I'm trying to make some money a little bit. Well, we need to bring some income in so that we can develop our lands. I'm going to try and do a couple of different things in the next episode and months just to bring some income in. Of course, we do have a credit line with the bank. Um, I'm still waiting for them to come through and tell me exactly how much it is, but in the meantime, let's push forward. So we'll get our sower mixed, mixed up, <laughs> get our sower hooked up, and uh, we'll start on this field in the front of us here. As I said, we're going to plant oats here as well, so we'll have two oat fields and a sorghum field. And then in the small field we will get ourselves a planter and I think we'll plant some maize in there just to get some sort of variation in our crops going. Okay, that's planting nicely. I do like this planter, it's uh, for relatively low horsepower, it gives us a nice good wingspans but so to speak so we can uh, plant six meters at a time and there we go that's the second field planted so two fields of oats so far let's get around to that top field and we'll go and uh, put some sorghum into that This field is going past here now, as I said, I'm going to get a planter and we will uh, plant some uh, maize in there, I think. We've got a lot of grass as well, so I think we will mow some, some of the grass and uh, we won't make it into silage. Um, We'll just make some hay and sell it, just to bring in some income. It's a bit of uh, meadow management, if you want to call it that. But that's for another episode. We won't be doing that. Um, we'll probably do that next month. Where are we now? We're in um, April now, yeah, so we'll probably do it in May. Just get a couple of headlands going, yeah? A nice big field of sorghum. They should all, well, um, the two fields of oats and the field of sorghum should be harvested at the same, around right about the same time. Hopefully in the same month, so that we don't have to um, lease. Also, we, well, we can get them both done in the terms of one lease of a harvester, if you get what I mean. So we can lease the harvester for one month and uh, get both, both all three fields um, harvested. Well, that's the plan. If it works out, we shall see. That's a couple of months down the line, of course. Just doing a little bit of up and downs. Of course, because this is a um, trail behind, the turning circle is fairly wide. So I just find it sometimes easier on the bigger fields to to do a wide turn. And uh, unfortunately, my uh, my eye is not that good to be able to get full widths. So we'll just <laughs> if you get what I mean. So we have these little bits to uh, to fill in as we finish off planting. 
right, this is the last little slither. And then we'll get this back to the sheds. Get it parked up. For future use. I think we've still got a bit, yeah, we've still got a bit of seed in there. So our seed usage has been pretty good, really. Well, they have been pretty small fields, but still. Right, we'll get this parked up. I think I'm going to put in another shed now. Another small one. Just to um, give us enough space to put the tractor away at night. It's a relatively inexpensive uh, wooden shed. Not sure I want it to go on this side. We could utilize that land a bit better, maybe for our homestead. We shall see. I think if we can we fit it in here? I think so. Yeah, just about. Good. Let's get it more or less squared off. I'm not too worried about everything looking the same at this point in time. what we can get and what we can buy. Right, let's get this done. It's looking okay. Hmm. Yeah, there we go. Give ourselves a little bit of space between the buildings just to walk through. I think we'll do a bit of landscaping and just uh, in front of that shed. Just make it look the same as the front of the other shed or similar. Before that, luckily I've just remembered, of course, we've built a shed, so we need to put up a, some sort of um, solar panel or or um, windmill. solar panel on the back here. They do fit rather nicely over here. It's not a windmill I was thinking of. So I was stuttering on my words. It's, it's, a, it's a wind generator. Good. Matches up quite nicely. Yeah, I seem to be having this little problem of um, forgetting forgetting things as I'm talking. <laughs> Maybe I should write it down. I suppose. <laughs> Any case, I'm still not sure I got that right. Right, so that's our shed there done. Let's get the bit of landscaping done in the front. Let's clear the grass and the bushes. For easy access, of course, that's what we need. Alright, what to use, what to use. So we want the we don't want wet mud. I think we want the uh, dirt. Where is it? There it is. There. I think that's the right one. Yep. 
Yep, that looks good. Just don't want to disturb the original stuff too much. The original um Original look of the check. There we go, that's not too bad. <coughs> like we'll add some splotches in of different things just to not make it look so uniform. A few leaves around. Okay, that looks quite good. So the next thing we need to do is go and get ourselves a plant at least so that we can get the maize planted and while we're doing that and we're at the shop I think we will sell our little ridgy track as well bring a little bit of income we're not really not using two tractors at the moment and I think if we do need two tractors I'd rather have two hurdlemans with a bit more oomph right that's at least let's get the Richard Track Salt, bring in about 38,000. Um, can kind of do with the money now. That's that done. Right, let's head off to the shop and go and pick up the pick up the planter. We'll get started on that. There it is. There we should still have some seed left in there. Hook it up and away we'll go. Let's fill it up. Nice. Don't have an awful lot left in there, but I think it should be enough to plant that one field. And we'll see once we get back to the field and we'll get started. Right, here we are back at the farm. Get this maize planted. Now that'll come out at a couple of months after the will be ready for harvest, should I say? Come out. We'll be ready for harvest a couple of months after the after the sorghum and the um, the oats are ready. So that's quite good. Here we go. Shouldn't take too long to plant this field. Oops, missed the edge there a little bit. It's not too much of a problem. Uh, the chickens are looking happy at the top there. Hopefully we'll be able to deliver our first batch of eggs soon. Start generating some income. Of course we are generating some income from our from our energy uh, production in terms of the solar panels. There's a little bit extra than we'd normally require which is getting put back into the into the power grid and that helps to um, to make the um, the town a little bit greener in terms of energy supply as well. Hopefully by the time we fully developed as a farm we'll be generating a lot of extra power for the for the town area. Well that's the idea in any event. There 
as we make more money we may even actually um, invest in some sort of um, some sort of um, energy energy generation for um, for the town as well to make sure it's fully sufficient because the town might grow as well so who knows well that's just about done well that is done in fact I think let's just have a quick look around yeah we're good that's a little bit there we'll plant that fantastic that's it all done and we'll get this back parked up Oh, that's a little bit that we must right at the beginning. <laughs> oh, yeah. Don't suppose it would have made a huge amount of difference to the overall yield, but uh, it would have worried me. I don't think it would have worried me, to be honest. <laughs> anyway, here there we go. Let's get this parked up. I don't think this is going to be fit in there. Might have just parked it around the back. Oh, what are you doing driving on the field, man? That's not good. I shall have to take myself into a corner and give myself a good talking to, I think. <laughs> okay, let's get this parked up. Oh dear, there's a... Uh, there's a trailer we are with. Let's get that cleared out of the way. We can put that in the shed actually. I think I can use this little space at the back here to keep some of the more sturdy implements that perhaps don't need to be under cover stored away instead of having to build a shed for them. Something to think about, I suppose. Let's get the trailer in the back here. Leave that outside in the rain, it'll quickly fill up with water. Well, uh, it'll drain out through the bottom, so it's not too much of a problem. <laughs> oh dear. Right, there we go. Get that parked up nicely. That's good. We're going to park up the planter. Not sure if I'll be creating any um, more fields soon, but um, it's relatively inexpensive to lease it, so just in case I'm going to just hang on to it for a little while, just until I can kind of formulate what the next move will be. There we go. That should sit nicely on that little bit of cement. Just wonderful sitting here trying, watching me trying to uh, park up implements, isn't it? Very exciting. <laughs> yeah. Right, so I think the next thing to do is to get um, these fields rolled. So let's go and get the roller out. Oops, we're going to have to move the plough first. So we'll get that hatched up, put that at the back as well. It's a pretty sturdy piece of equipment that. We're about to get the roll out and get our fields rolled up. <laughs> that doesn't sound right. <laughs> roll up the fields. Get our fields rolled. Luckily this is, a, as I said, a pretty sturdy piece of equipment so it shouldn't be too much of a problem to park it up at the back here. It's becoming quite a useful little area now. 
just drop that off there and go and pick up the roller and get started. Well, I think that's where I'm going to start winding up this episode. Um, I've got a couple of, I suppose, more mundane things done. The seeding of the fields and the planting of the fields, all necessary to have that done. Trying to talk and drive the tractor at the same time and just about taking the shed down. This is not a very good advert for my driving abilities at the moment. What's my excuse? Oh, I'm still getting used to an electric vehicle. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Any excuse will do. <laughs> yeah, as I said, so we did, uh, it's been a pretty routine um, episode. Um, but then again, farming has quite a bit of routine in it, so um, that's all part of it. Uh, as we start rolling this field, it shouldn't take too long. We'll get all the all the fields that we just planted rolled. Of course, we also built that new shed, and we sold our ridgey track. So, yeah. Well, so I won't say the most exciting episode. Um, things have happened. Things have been done any case so as we feel as we finish this field as we feel this finish <laughs> as we finish this field thank you so much for watching do hope you're enjoying this series if you are please like and subscribe it does help us out in trying to grow the channel and it would be much much appreciated well, in the next episode, I think we will be doing a bit of meadow management. So we'll be doing a bit of a grass cut. And I think we will produce some hay out of that and get that sold, get some more income from that. And then uh, I have a very exciting plan for May. A new development and a new venture on the farm which I think will be pretty exciting so do come back and find out what that is well we just about finished the rolling now I think maybe one one more pass or so Gonna be are we gonna make one more pass in there? I think so. <laughs> well there we go. Okay. Once again, thank you so much for watching. And as I said earlier, if you are enjoying this series, please like and subscribe. And we'll catch you in the next one. Cheerio!